Sonia Snell by Sir Cyril Fletcher. This is the tale of Sonia Snell, to whom an accident befell, an accident it may be seen embarrassing in the extreme. It happened as it does to many that Sonia went to spend a penny and entering with modest grace the properly appointed place provided at the railway station that she sat in contemplation. Unfortunately unacquainted, the seat had been newly painted, which made poor Sonia realise her inability to rise and though she struggled, pulled and yelled, she found that she was firmly held. She raised her voice in mournful shout, won't someone come and help me out? Her cries for help then quickly brought a crowd of every kind and sort who stood around and feebly sniggered and all they said was I'll be jiggered. Go blimey said the ancient porter they ought to soak her up with water. The station master and his staff were most perverse and did not laugh but pulled at Sonia's hands and feet but could not get her off the seat. A carpenter arrived at last and finding Sonia still stuck fast he said I know what I can do and quickly sawed the seat right through. Sonia arose only to find a wooden halo on behind. An ambulance came down the street and bore her off complete with seat to take the wooden bustled gal off quickly to the hospital. They hustled Sonia off inside after a short but painful ride and seizing her by heels and head they laid her face down on the bed. The doctors all came on parade to render her immediate aid. The surgeon said, upon my word, could anything be more absurd? Have any of you, I implore, seen anything like this before? Yes, said the student, unashamed, frequently, but never framed. <laughs>